Hey Sean, I got the 2015 Chevy Silverado here for you. It's got about 106,000 miles for you to get you a video walk around as well. It's always better than just a couple pictures. Still in the front, so you got nice fog lights on here. Good looking Chevy front end. It's got a lot of fr frost on the, on the hood. Looks like it's in good shape. As well as the windshield, no crack, cracks or chips or anything. Uh, so you got alloy wheels on here. You got lots of tread on the tires. It looks like we won't even need to change those. Looks like it's pretty good on the under, under underside. It's got running boards, make it easy to get in and out. You got your big towing mirrors. Uh, and it's obviously needs to be detailed, but it does have power controls for the seats. Got a nice size screen with back with a backup camera. So it's actually a six heater, so you can get an additional person in there, and you still get the console. So I go in the back. Like I said, this is a double cab, so it's still got the four doors that replace the old extended cab. So I got that seat up where like I would be comfortable. So you do still get a good amount of space back here. I'm assuming I'm the most comfortable in the world as a grown adult. Having kids back here would have have no problem or if you need to transport people for shorter distance I wouldn't be any problem at all and like I said I've got the seat actually pretty pretty far back um, so it does have a six and a half foot box so there's like a rubber mat down on the bottom uh, it does have a soft tunnel cover that can be folded down so again it looks really good on the underside coming about around the back get your hitch and wiring and go the other side. I and mean, overall, it's in really good, really good shape. A lot of times, these uh, heavy-duty trucks come in pretty, pretty beat up, but this one's not the case. So yeah, let me know what you think of this one. We'd be happy to help you out on this. Thank you.